just wrapped up my morning routine as you all can see i got everything checked off the list i read my bible prayed i journaled did my knee rehab and i did my push-ups each and every morning of course if you all have been watching my videos you all know that i like to read my bible pray journal like those are my non-negotiables for the day and i've also added two new things to my morning routine one by choice one not by choice so of course you all know that i'm injured and now i have to do some extra things in order to work my way back had to do my knee rehab and also i'm doing push-ups just to get my blood flowing in i'm not gonna lie i just want to get a tad bit bigger so i threw them in there nonetheless that's how i'm gonna get my day started from now on and you know i'm gonna try it out and see how it goes hopefully 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 it goes well but i don't really see how it can go bad to me having a morning routine is only beneficial it's a way for you to put certain things in place to make sure that you start your day off great consistently and to me it's a way for me to put my mind at ease as well just put my mind at ease by knowing okay i woke up i did what i had to do you know i control what i could control in the morning time i got my day started off this way so hopefully it'll follow in that way so if i start my day off great do my routine, check everything off, I'll feel accomplished, feel good, and hopefully the rest of the day will follow. Not saying, not saying that it's gonna happen like that. You're gonna have several days where you'll do everything right, and then you just probably won't have a good day, and that's okay too, but having a morning routine in place definitely helps you increase your chances of having a great day. Like I said, my morning routine is a way for me to control what i can control now in the morning time okay yes these small things are in my control i can choose whether or not i want to read my bible i can choose whether or not i want to pray i can choose whether or not i want to journal stretch rehab do push-ups all this stuff but anything that follows after that is not really in my control but as long as i control the controllables i know the other stuff like give or take I'm satisfied with how it goes. If I have a great day, great. If I have a bad day, I'm okay with that because I know at the end of the day, I did what I could in order to get the day started off on the right foot. I'm not really gonna talk you all's head off, but make sure you have your little morning routine. It doesn't have to be a morning routine, like a daily routine. It could be an afternoon routine, evening routine, whatever it is. Make sure you have a routine set in place that of course works for you gets you going gets you in that right mindset a positive mindset and sets you up for the rest of the day whatever you may have going on hopefully this morning routine will go ahead and speed up the healing of this bad boy right here i don't know about y'all man but i'm having a great morning thus far and it's only about to get greater about to head to the gym we have practice this morning at 10 30 well the girls have film weights and practice me i only have my rehab stuff so weights today is a lower body day today is a lower body day my knee is feeling it's feeling better than before by far but you know still some work that needs to be done so we about to go to the gym we about to put in some great work you know it's so important to have your morning routine to get everything in check you know get yourself feeling good and set the tone for the day so about to head to the gym about to go put in some great work and you know i'm pretty optimistic about my injury feeling pretty optimistic about the recovery how it's feeling so today hopefully 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 i can touch a basketball do something with a basketball it's been two weeks bro it's been two weeks your girl is in a drought i'm going through withdrawal i'm like <laughs> I can't do it but hey this is my life right now this is my journey you know it's something that i had to go through in order to get to where i'm going so i'm trusting god 100 percent i know that he has a greater purpose for my life even if it is small and minuscule like it's still an inconvenience and not being able to play is hard bro it's crazy hard like but it is what it is man today's gonna be a great day i hope you all are having a great day i hope you all <clears throat> somebody watching me but today's gonna be a great day about to go put some great work in then afterwards gonna come back and just continue having a great day man let's get some tunes to set the tone for the day hey what let's see what we about to play real quick just to get a little vibe oh, I 
me, send me, 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 me. <laughs> I don't even know that song, but I'm just trolling right now. Let's go ahead and go get this working, man. I know y'all seen me earlier putting that work and here's a little injury update my knee is actually starting to feel well it's still a bit painful certain movements but a hey, range of motion is there and you know we got a solid foundation to build on and that's what we're gonna do right now it is currently it's 4 40 p.m got back from practice and i've just been chilling being lazy right now i'm watching some youtube but look got the ice on the knee youtube on the tv just chilling i need to do some editing because i have a video that i want to drop on sunday and i have this video i have nothing but time on my hands so i'm just about to put out a whole bunch of videos but hey i'm proud of myself for today and yesterday the day before that you know the past two weeks i've been doing whatever i can rehabbing and all that just trying to get back so you gotta make sure you so let, let me tell you something you gotta make sure you celebrate the small wins like you can't just wait till something extravagant something so big happens for you to be proud of yourself for you to clap for yourself and you know celebrate yourself celebrate the small wins celebrate everything in between because like i said in a video before this i know for a fact the small wins are gonna lead up to the big win but if you don't celebrate the small wins nine times out of ten you ain't gonna celebrate the big win either and don't be that person I'm talking to myself i'm talking to you kiki i'm talking to you i used to be that person where i wasn't happy with anything but i've had to tell myself time and time and time again you're blessed don't let these moments pass you by just because you're so wrapped up on what's next i'm all i used to always think like what's next what's next okay i get this but something more like more 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 but now i'm learning to live in the moment celebrate the small wins and i promise you it's so much better than what i was doing before so you make sure you do the same i'm just chilling me ice on my knee in my living room right now on a saturday evening and my team is getting ready to travel to poco Vise tomorrow yet again and i will be here alone but it is what it is like i said it's my situation right now so i got to make the best of it and i'm looking at this like okay now that i'm not playing i'm not traveling i have a lot more time to spend on content so i'm going to make the best of it of course i'm going to continue to rehab do what i can to get back out there help my team contribute and you know help us reach our goals for the season As you all can see, I'm currently working. Even when I'm not working, I'm still working. Don't let that go over your heads. But hey, it's currently 8.08 p.m. I'm sitting down, I'm editing a YouTube video that's gonna post right before this one. So if you're seeing this right now and you haven't checked out my last vlog, go check it out, man. But I think this is gonna wrap up today's vlog. It's gonna wrap up a very productive day because I woke up, did my morning routine, did what I had to do, handle my business, and then the rest of the day was easy breezy. So I'm about to finish editing this video, man. My days are pretty boring now, so I don't have much to show you all, but I'm still gonna be vlogging because like I said in my first video, this is gonna be a real, raw, and authentic channel. And I'm gonna let you all in on the good times and the bad times so y'all can see what a life of an overseas pro basketball player is truly like. But 
the injured version. So, with that being said, man, let me finish this video because, hey, your girl almost... I ain't gonna really say it, but make sure y'all keep watching my vlogs, man. Make sure you give this video a thumbs up. If you're new to my channel and you made it to this point, hit that subscribe button down below. Hey, come join me on my journey. And... <sighs> I really wish I was playing on Sunday, but it is what it is, man. With that being said, I'm Kiki Calloway. Thank you all for tuning in to another vlog, man. I'm out.